Hey everyone, and welcome to a tower defense game. Um, I think this was it Guardians of Home or something? Home? Homey? I don't know. H O L M E, I think. But, um, saw this on Steam. Came out, uh, not recently. But, um, yeah, I love tower defense games, and this is also a deck building game. Which I love the deck building RNG type games, so. Let's see how this plays. Engage in a fierce battle. Okay, this is the battle phase. Got it. This is really loud. I'm turning it down on my end. Hopefully, don't have to turn it down for you guys. But I'll, I'll, uh, I'll worry about that in post. All right, brave challenge. Add two jackals to every wave. Or no, let's not make it hard or anything. Let's just go. Okay, here we go. So this is where they're going to travel. They have to get to here. What is this? Paralysis floor. Attacks bounce five times with a 5% chance to inflict paralysis. Okay. So they have to step on that. So make them... Okay. Let's see. How does this work? 4,600 wood or lumber or whatever it is. And these each card has a cost on it. Alright. An arrow trap. Deal damage to the first enemy within range. Can only be placed on a wall. To like here. Yeah. Roadblock. Prevents enemies from moving forward. Enemies will prioritize changing their path. So I could put it here. Now it makes them go over to paralysis plate. Which is great. Uh, let's do... I don't know. What, what's a spine trap? Periodically deal area damage. Oh, it goes on the ground. Can we just put it there? I don't know, do we just spend all of our money? Is that what we do? Oil tar. Slow enemies. Uh, okay, let's slow them here. Put this here. So that they're slow when they come around this corner and then this thing will start pelting them. We can also shoot this way. Okay. Let's try this. I don't know if it's going to work. I have no idea. Oh, well that was easy as hell. Okay, I see. Oh, and it just moves. It doesn't look like there's pauses in between the waves. Are money going up or building... Resources or whatever. Okay, that's round one or wave one And then wave two is gonna start Right now, okay, I see that's cool. What is this disable? Disabled against flying units place a clamp trap deal 250 damage to the first enemy that steps in it and stun it for one second So just like a one-time use thing like a, a, a panic button if you will That would be my guess. Because there's no cost on it. Okay. Um, I feel like we don't need anything yet. Let's count one out of two. Are we able to... Oh, we can level up. Okay, that was going to be the next question. Level this up. Level it again? No, you can't level it up again. Level that up. Okay, well, I definitely understand how to play freaking, you know, tower defense games. Made this real easy because of my knowledge in tower defense games. But, um, yeah, the, the card aspect of this game, like drawing the cards, very interesting. I enjoyed it a lot. Why did it pause? Am I supposed to be worried about something? I just sped it up. Is it because this is like the final two waves? Okay. It looks like I'm fine.
Okay. Nice. So I could have done that better. Because if you saw the, the skip button right here, the ward was listed under it and it was sticking down. So if you hit that, I think it just immediately starts the next wave. While the wave that you just skipped is going. So, um, you know, we would have been able to handle all of that with just those three floor traps and the arrows. Uh, let's see. Rewards. No damage reward. Early waves reward. See, this would have been a lot more. Okay. <clears throat> and card. Ooh, we add this to our hand. A dart trap. Cheap traps that fire small darts quickly. Okay, 0.4 seconds. This is decreased defense of enemies by 25 for 3 seconds. It goes off every 3 seconds and lasts for 3 seconds. A debuff that reduces physical armor. Okay. And a fire trap. Ignite enemies with intense flames and deal 15 burn damage every second for 3 seconds. I like that. I like that. Okay. Oh, let's see here. You get a trap here. You can enhance your or learn skills. You can enhance a trap. You can remove two traps. No, let's go. Let's go up this way. Increases the damage of nearby traps by fifteen percent. Sure. So I could put that like in a corner and then have like you know two arrow traps on the wall. Okay. Uh, you can enhance the trap to make it stronger. What's this? Do we get this too? Increased burn duration. Well, we did get a burn trap. Okay. Uh, whenever a trap kills an enemy, you increase its damage by 3% for 10 seconds. Ooh. We'll reset when the relic is triggered again. So I, I don't understand how relics work. This is... These aren't like potions that you just take. I think they're items that you just have. And you can, you know, you get multiple of them. When using pets to kill enemies... Do 150 damage to... Okay, let's... Let's go with the fire one. And we'll go here. Make a trap stronger. How does this look upgrading? I don't know. Confirm. Do it. Okay. And we'll go to the battle. Alright. Ooh, we want him to go that way. Nine fire damage every second for seven seconds. So if I do this, they have to go that way now. Um, this increases the damage of nearby traps by 15%. So it would increase that one. Right? Let's see. Let's see if it does. I'm going to put it on. This is nine damage every second. So let's put this on here. Nine damage. I don't know. Okay, fire trap. Just like that. Um, oil tar, let's slow them down so they stay in the fire longer. This arrow trap can shoot all the way, not all the way, but a good portion. Um, this, this, and can we upgrade our fire trap? Upgrade, I don't think we have enough to upgrade anything else. Okay, let's just try this. Yeah, we want to upgrade this. Now, let's let's go ahead and skip and see what happens. I'm going to do it again right when it comes up. Skip. Let's upgrade this. You can upgrade the roadblocks, but why? May maybe certain enemies try to get through the roadblocks. That could be it. Okay, he's slowed. Oh, he summons. Okay. Yeah, he, he's going to die from that fire, though. Okay. Um, I, I think we're good. We'll put another trap here just because that summoning guy was, like, getting relatively far. the next wave. Like, 
they don't stand much of a chance here. Okay, here comes the summoner. Yeah, we're just crapping on these guys. I know this game's probably gonna, like, get hard all of a sudden. But for right now, it, it's pretty easy. I love it. This is a lot of fun. Alright, let's, let's speed this up. Get it. Real easy. Yeah, early waves. Now we got 30 instead of 10. Uh, nail trap springboard. Bounce enemies within range to a certain direction. Can I bounce them off the map into a void? We're buying that. Because I'm going to try it. I'm definitely trying that. Holy shit. Because as you saw, there were empty areas there where there was nothing. I couldn't build on it. It was just a hole. I wonder if I can just, like, spring trap them in there. Or maybe there's, like, a, a push thing, on, a push trap that you can get on a wall. I bet that's one of the traps. And you can push them over, like a square. And just push them into the void. That'll be great. Get a trap here. Okay. Oh, I thought this went through the middle. Um, get a trap here. Spin gold. Ooh, let's do that. You can make... You can rest. We don't need to rest. I'm, I'm fine, baby. Paralysis floor. Acid. Oil car. Let's go to oil car. I mean, we already have one. But if we line two of them up, or one... Skip a spot and then another one. Yeah. I like that idea. Uh, grab this. When killing enemies with pits, push the nearest two enemies with a push strength of 75. I don't think I have pits. Or the pit shooting them into the void like I thought. Pits cannot be traversed by ground enemies. So yeah, this is what I'm trying to do now. Every 100 push strength can move a monster with 100 weight by one cell. Uh, okay. So, your push strength basically is one weight. So, 75. Strength of 75, you can push monsters that weigh less than 75. Got it. Uh, every five traps in your deck increase initial materials by five. When there are less than six cards in your deck, increase the number of traps. No, let's do this. I'm, I'm going to start using pits. And we can spend gold. What do we spend gold on? A field generator. This is 1,200. Attack all enemies on the map. What? Oh. Okay. So is this just like I can upgrade the trap in my hand? That's nice. What are these? Triggered one time every 60 seconds, dealing 200 damage to the first enemy about to reach the core. When there are less than 7 traps on the field, increase the damage of all your traps by 30%. Uh, shield your core from one attack. Can get traps from bonfire. Um, decrease the attack delay by 17%. I don't know, let's just keep, keep on going. Let's keep moving on. Okay. Um, this is fine with me. Let's go fight. Do we have roadblocks? We need to block this off. And we need to block this off. Oil tar here. Fire trap. Could go here. Okay, this is good. This is good. Springboard. Perfect. How do we know? Okay, spring them that way. That should work, right? I don't see why that wouldn't work. Unless you're springing them this far, but I doubt it. How do I know how much something weighs? Um. Like, where's my, like... Do I have, like, a monster itinerary 
something that tells me where the monsters, like, about the monsters that I've seen. Maybe back on the main menu, but not here. I don't know. All right, I wish it was here, though. What is this? Rock trap. One-time trap. Once I activated this trap, we'll roll and went... Oh, so you can roll a rock this way. Got it. All right. You just play it. I want to see this springboard. You can level... Let's level it up. Ready? Didn't push him very far. Didn't push him, he died. Dude, I don't know what their weight is. They attack 35. I can't tell what their weight is. Is their weight their health? Because if so, they're 75. Those guys are 10. Yeah, it, it does just throw them off. That's hilarious. You more than 400 damage with a single, I don't know. Throwing people, oh god, I love that. Oh, I love that so much. How do I see my relics? I saw them somewhere. Are they here? Yeah, what does this do? When killing enemies with pits, push the nearest two enemies with a push strength. Okay, but where are you pushing them? I don't know. Alright, uh, this would be good. Buff all three of these in damage. Upgrade this. Upgrade this. Upgrade this so that your attack is 93. 93. Uh, can't tell what the attack iron is. 50. Um, let's, we can put this here. Cause why not? See, these big guys you can't push. This isn't strong enough. I even upgraded it. The push strength is 110. It's normally 75. Okay, let's just speed it up. Double time, baby. Well, that's triple time, but you know. Okay. Next wave, why not? Those big guys are dying quick. Well, that was easy. Nice. All right. Uh, let's keep it going. A hook trap. The enemy is pulled in one direction and takes damage with a strength of 110. So could I pull them across a pit and they fall in a pit? We're trying it. Hell yeah, we're trying it. Or does it pull them across the pit to the other side? Because if so, that, that could be bad. Uh, there might be various encounters. Get a trap card. Enhance a trap card. You can rest or... Yeah, let's try let's try this. Because I want to springboard. This is a push strength is 95. I thought it was 75. Uh, maybe... I don't know. Or is that upgraded? Yeah, it's... I think it's upgraded. 95. Okay. Where's, like... There's no, like, monster glossary or anything. Recover HP. I don't know what I expected here. Okay. Alright, this is a... Boss or mini-boss battle? Let's see... I need to block this off. And probably this, if we can. Okay. Tap one time trap, such as a rock trap, to trigger them. Okay. Let's see. Vogue block here. Now they do just walk through that, you idiots. Okay, well I guess it is like the quickest route. But it still didn't make much sense for them. Um. Oh, I should have put the spring trap here. Damn it. <laughs> Alright, we're fine. Everything's fine. 
Okay. Put the fire trap here and point it down. Upgrade this. Upgrade this. What else can we upgrade? We'll upgrade the spring trap. Alright, let's do it. Alright, we're going into the next wave as soon as we can. Yeah, there's gotta be a way to tell, like, what the weight is on enemies, you know? That plays a role into your cards. Alright, uh, let's point this this way. And upgrade. Okay. We're on wave three. I know right now we're smooth sailing, but that boss is going to come out at some point. Oh my god, it does just pull him in. I love that. It just holds him. <laughs> it's just holding him here. That's hilarious. Put this here. Oh my god, that's funny as hell. I like the hook trap. It, it fires pretty quickly. Like that's not even upgrade. Let's upgrade. Okay, um put this here. We'll shut this here. We have another hook trap. Oh, can I Yeah, we're putting it here. When I get the hook trap, we're firing it this way. Alright, here we go. We need 300, and I'm putting another hook trap right here. How many kills does that thing have? Nine. Alright, hook trap here. Point that way. Oh my god, I love the hook trap so much. And I can springboard him back into the hook trap. Let's do it. Love the hook traps. Alright. I mean, this is going really well. What happens if we upgrade one of these? It's at 300 health now. It was at 200. So I'm guessing at some point you're going to run into a monster that does attack your shit. Last wave. Alright, let's, let's go one speed here because I want to see the boss come out. And like, just totally kick my ass. These guys aren't going to make it past this fire trap. The normal guys. Even these big giant orcs. Okay, here's the boss. Boss troll. He did 75% health. Okay. No, this isn't good. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Oh god. Not good. Get him. Get him. Oh! My last arrow. I mean, I think this, this pit would have killed him. But, like, I didn't have any damage after that. Because that springboard I had wasn't going to throw him into the pit. He's too heavy. Alright, the spring traps are fun, but not as fun as the hook traps. Alright, you can remove two traps. I don't know if we need to do that. Are there any trap cards that I get that I don't like? I don't think so. Enhance a trap. No, let's just go this way. Smash all enemies on contact and store damage dealt. After every 20 damage dealt, convert to one overheat. After overheat reaches the limit, the trap will be disabled until overheat resets by default. Okay. Attack at a thousand. I'm I'm gonna put that first. What the hell? 
hell? When an enemy dies while frozen, alright, we don't know how to do that. Deal damage equal to 10% of max health to all surrounding enemies. Oh shit. So you like crystallize them and then it pops and then like icicles come out basically. Alright, if an enemy dies to this damage, they will be considered to have died while frozen. So this could just chain to a ton of people. Okay. Um, when, when using pits to kill enemies, you'll 150 damage to the enemy closest to the court. Yeah, let's do that. Because I'm using pits. Uh, spin gold. Harvest. If enemies die within range, get 8 material. Nail trap. Nail pops out of the wall, hits enemies, pushes them back. Yes. I want one of those. Um, this is on sale. Let's grab it. What is this? When number of traps on the field are less than 12, decrease the attack delay. Alright. I guess I could have bought the enhanced trap and put it on something, but you know what? Whatever. What is this? Oh, this is where they come out. Okay. I thought they come out over here and I thought there was like a teleporter or something. It is a teleporter, but not one that we need to be concerned with. Okay. So. We want them to go this way. And then we want another roadblock here. And here. Yes. Definitely what we want. Nail trap. Pushes enemies, right? Pushes them. Pushes them back. So is it just going to smack them and they just go kind of backwards? Yeah, they're going to go back up that way. So let's put the fire trap here. And an oil tar trap here. Springboard them this way. I like having this at first. It seems to do a lot of damage. Alright, let's try this. So let's put the oil tar trap here so they, they come out slow. And maybe that the spikes in the ground can hit him twice. Alright, here we go. Let's see how this works. If it works. Okay. That fire trap is killing everybody. Let's put another fire trap here. Alright. Uh, we need to upgrade this as soon as we can. Uh, we got it. We'll upgrade the, uh, whatever they're called. What are they? Spine traps? I would call them spike traps, but spine trap works. Uh, this, if you upgrade it, I guess you can maybe slow them farther, but I don't know. Alright, uh, probably want to upgrade our fire trap. Unless we want an arrow trap here. Might, ooh, an arrow trap here would be good. It'd shoot down this way. Because it shoots, what, three spots? One, two, three? Yeah, up here would be great. We need 600 for that. All right, let's speed it up a little bit. Okay, the arrow trap here. Level it up, and then level this up. Um, okay, last wave, here we go. So we got a hook trap. I love the hook trap. And upgrade it. Alright, there we go. I don't I don't know if the hook trap will be able to go because we're killing everything. Maybe a couple things get to this tar pit, but. Everything's like dying. Yeah, nothing's making it down there. Damn. Right, what do we? A 
Sunken Trap. Deal damage to passing enemies quickly. I don't know what that means, but I'm gonna do it. Uh, spin gold, get a trap, enhance a trap, learn skills. Let's go here. Let's enhance uh, the pulverizer. Hmm. Hmm. This does seven damage. But what my concern is, you see, this has an attack delay of 1.5. This has no attack delay, but it only does seven damage. This does 35. So does that mean these spikes are just there all the time? And they have to walk through it? Is that what that means? What do we just upgrade this again? Can we upgrade that again? We can't. Let's just do that. Uh, oh, these are new skills. Oh, you can use it every 45 seconds? Interesting. Applied net effect to enemies. Okay, that net effect snares and glues them to the ground. Uh, place a proximity triggered bomb that will knock up enemies within two cells. Decrease this to 40 seconds. Let's just, I didn't know it was on a cooldown. I thought it was a one time thing, so I was saving it as my like, oh shit button. Didn't know it was a cooldown, now I'm going to be using it because it's free, right? It doesn't cost me like anything. Flash trap. Oh, this is how you... Okay, chills and slows. Got it. So if we put this here, they have to go. Oh shit! They go that way. You don't don't want that. Do not want that. Put it here. All right, make them go that way. Perfect. That's a long way to go. Pulverizer trap is expensive, but I'm also gonna set it here because it might be hilarious. The sunken trap. I want to see it. Springboard. I'm, I'm gonna make that the very first thing they step on, just because I like seeing people go flying into the pit. Um, and then we could put spine traps along here. Ooh, there's my big fire trap. Okay, we'll do the big fire trap. Okay, let's let's try this. Let's zoom it in so we can see. And let's play. So that, okay, that fishing rod that I have, when it says it pushes two enemies when I kill someone with a pit, it looks like it pulls them towards the guy that went into the pit, which would make sense. It's a fishing rod, and the fishing rod's grabbing him and pulling him down. And that, that ticks a lot of damage. Like... Holy crap. Alright. Uh, upgrade this. Upgrade this. They might not even get to the pulverizer. Especially if I put a slow here. This is killing everybody. I mean, I love it. Alright, here we go. No, you didn't even get to the pulverizer. I don't think we're going to even need the pulverizer. Oh, we might. We got a lot of waves. And we've also got this hook trap. You can bet your ass we are shooting people with this hook trap. It tries to grab someone, but they're dead before the hook even gets there. I wonder if I put the hook trap here, he'd kind of like go off to the side. I doubt it, but you never know. It's killing so many people. So many people are dying. Oh my god. No, it's throwing them that way. It throws them up. Change direction. There we go. Now it throws them down. And they hit their... They gotta walk over the springboard again. I could sell that and get 520 for it. Don't want to sell that one. What is this? Prevents enemies from moving forward, but will not change enemy pathing. 
Oh, it just... They have to attack it. Okay. Got it. Um, I thought if I upgrade these enough, they'll turn into, like, a makeshift wall, and I can put traps on them, but I guess not. Because last time I tried that, and it just, like, put another peg in there, and the hit points went up by 100. But it didn't, like, grow. Like, there's a lot of... Okay. Uh-oh. Somehow that thing died. I don't know how he died. How do we do this? You draw all the cards in your hand. Okay. Um, arrow trap. Like this. Level up. Level this up. There we go. They're, they'll take care of the freaking... Balloon guys. People automatically just flew off into the void. That hook dragged him in. The hook got 15 kills. This thing got 43 kills. That's hilarious. Hey, look at this. They just walk into death. Literally. They spawn and walk into death. Bury seven or more units in one second. Holy shit. That's crazy. This is... For the Demon King. Alright, just... Stop. That was hilarious. I love that. Oh my god, I love that so much. A net trap. Fire a net immobilizes. Uh, flying enemy will be shot down. I guess I gotta take one, don't I? I don't have to take one. Can I hit cancel? Yeah, you can. Okay. Um, I don't want this because it's gonna be like, hey, you can heal. I don't want to heal. So we're going this way. A hook trap. Yes. Uh, I need strength. You get a wooden doll, a natural altar, or recover hit points. First time damage is taken every battle. Prevent that damage. Okay, well... We've been fine. We're not even close to, like, getting damage done. Increase skill damage by 15%. Using skills... Oh, yeah, I forgot to use my trap. Okay. Let's, let's go with that, I guess. And we can turn around and leave. Alright. Here comes the boss. Last level. Lord Ball. Lord of Worship. Excels at commanding heavy armor. Units and... Oh... Commanding heavy armor units. And move slowly. All enemies except the boss gain 5 armor. Okay. Oh boy, this is a big map. What is this? Periodically deal damage to an enemy within range. An enemy, so just one enemy. But you hit for 60. That's quite a bit. Um. Roadblock this. Where are they going? They go down through here. Okay. Springboard this. I'm going to put the pulverizer right there. The very first thing you're going to walk into. Arrow trap with an upgrade. Hook trap. I don't know, because I want to I wanna roadblock this. Oh shit, now they go that way. Don't want that. Down and around. Okay. That works. Alright, let's let's try this. We're definitely gonna need more like damage stuff. That pulverizer, holy shit. That overheat, it overheats, and then you have to wait for it to cool down. It takes a while to cool down. Okay, now everybody through. And then after that, there's no... I don't have any traps. Like, they're, they're home free, basically. 
put this here because they step in this and then this starts shooting at them. Uh, oh, the sunken trap. Here. Did you do another hook trap? But there's, there's no pit to pull them into. We need to upgrade this, though. I want to put a roadblock or something right here. I don't think we have another roadblock, though. What do we do right here? I could put a roadblock here and make them go all the way around this way. Because this would do some damage. Let's do that. Let's put a roadblock here. What do you mean a new entrance? I paused it. What? No! Okay, well we failed this. I didn't know that's what was gonna happen. Okay. Um... That throws a, a big wrench in things. Okay, sell this. Uh, fire trap. He, oh, we could do a hook here. Like this. Fire trap here. Uh, I, think, I think we might be okay over here. So what is this that keeps going off? I forget how that triggers. I know what's going off. It's the, the javelin. This. So it just deals 150 damage to the enemy closest to the core when I knock somebody into the pit. Great. Okay. Um, that's not cool. Okay. Well, that sucks. Um, we can springboard here. How are we doing over here? We're, we're fine over here. Upgrade this again. Right, this is a boss troll. He spawned at this one. He, that's annoying. He's fine though. I mean, it'll be okay. Maybe. Okay. Um, let's put this here. So things can do more damage. Okay. Okay. Oh yeah, we have this. I forgot about that. Uh, put it here. Why not? Increase skill damage. Units. And it's gone already. Uh, using skills will deal 300 damage. Okay, so we can just place it anywhere? Hey, yeah, just place it anywhere. Doesn't sound like, you know, it needs to be adjacent to your skill or anything. Okay. Uh, level this up. Make him even slower. This guy made it a far away. I'm impressed. Ugh. All right, we might fail this because I didn't know how that beginning was gonna go, and then I kind of panicked. I mean, it's fine now, but I don't know how this boss is gonna be. All right, 375. I'm gonna upgrade this. Fire trap. This is upgraded, right? Yes. Okay. We got a, a mini boss coming. I could put this here. But why not? Okay. 
speed it up a little bit. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to kill this guy. We should. We killed one over here, right? Oh, I, I don't know how he popped. Oh, was it using a skill? I think it's using a skill. So I used it by placing it. Okay, I got you. I got you. Makes sense. These are upgraded. This is upgraded. All this stuff is upgraded. I could upgrade this. Um, this I could put here. Make it slap upward. I don't know which way it's hitting. There we go. Yeah, move them upward. Okay. Um, springboard. Now, let's do a spine trap. I don't know if they'll touch this. I don't know. Okay. Uh, oil trap. So this thing can get more shots off. Put this here. All right, here comes the boss wave. Upgrade our flamethrower down here. I think we're I think we're okay. Where's the boss at? If he comes out this door, we're just fucked. That's not even fair. Okay. He should be spawning here in a second. Okay, there he is. Yeah, everything's coming out the top. That's what he said. Fire makes you weak. Okay, well, he, he walked through that like a, no problem. Okay. We might be in trouble. I think we're definitely in trouble. Because this helps to keep like, going up. No, maybe not. It looked like it was. I think it's just the way he's moving. Like the frame rate he... You know? Okay, here comes our death. This is it. We'll slow it back down. Here it goes. What a feeble attack. I agree. That springboard did nothing to you. And you're fine. Our skills came into play, and we won. Win with more than 30 traps on the field. Win a boss level after calling in all waves. Oh, I did all. I guess I did all waves. Okay. Uh, ooh, periodically fire a powerful bolt to deal massive damage to a single enemy, and get and get extra 150% bonus damage. Machine gun. That sounds like fun. And a relic. Increase initial material by 2,400. So you start with more. That might be nice. The first two roadblock traps. Ooh, I like that. I like that a lot. Uh, nope. I'm, we're definitely doing this. Okay. And this is the next boss. This flying guy. Okay. Well, this is World 2. I'm going to end this video here. This is a hell of a lot of fun. Having a great time with this game. But, yeah, you should check this game out, definitely. It's got good reviews on Steam, too. But if you like tower defense or card games, or both, you'd love this. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.